Hi. You want a hug? You had your arms out. You want a hug from me? Yeah, this will probably be the last heart for this episode. Fix, go up! Fix! I used to play this game. The reason why this game is so special to me, besides just being good, I can't get out of the water, is I used to play it with a friend. Basically, I, I met this person and I asked them if they had ever played Vex and they were so thrilled to find another person that had played the game like they had. Basically, he and I were the only two people, I believe, that have ever played Vex in our lives. <laughs> it was really cool finding another person that had played this game and enjoyed it as much as I did. And uh, sometimes I would... I did not mean to do that. Okay, I hopefully it's... What am I doing? Okay. I actually pressed the R button, which activates your, like, extra power. So, whoopsie. Looks like I got it back, though. I think I stopped it before it drained too much. But anyway, yeah. I would go over to his house sometimes, and we'd play Vex. I would help him through the really hard areas, which was kind of fun. I remember there was one time where he was messing with the TV. He kept changing the color settings on the TV, and he made the whole screen super pink. It was weird. I would never... I don't know. I'm too paranoid. I wouldn't mess with the TV settings because I'd be afraid I couldn't uh, change it back. <laughs> but it was funny. Pink Vex was funny. I liked playing Pink Vex. <laughs> By the way, I didn't mention this before. There is a silly rumor that you could get a cow suit for Vex if you went to some secret area. There's apparently... What they said is there's apparently a fake tree in this area. And if you went into the fake tree or something weird, you would get a, uh, you would get a cow suit, and Vex would apparently be able to squirt milk at people. That is a false rumor. That is, that, that is a myth. I actually looked for it. I actually did look for the cow suit, but there is no cow suit. So, just thought I'd, I'd bring that up to you guys. No such thing. I want to show you guys- I don't want to risk dying after collecting shards. I kind of want to show you guys what happens with the- with the, uh, big dinosaur thingy. Ah! Ah! Oh my gosh, how's it not killed me yet? Wow! Woo! Woo! Okay, we're safe. This thing is not as threatening as I remember. Because normally it would get me. This one just kind of just... This time, it kind of just walked around me. But uh, yeah, that's the big frightening monster thing. Probably was a good pet at one point, but it's very hungry and it wants to kill me. Woohoo! Oh! Oh! I bumped into it. Vex, you need to get up! Whoa! Whoops! Yeah. Okay, so let's collect the shards. Ooh, there's another. What am I doing? Oh, that was a bad idea! Whoa! <laughs> well, I got eaten. Should be able to get a few in here. Whoops! <laughs> Whoa! <laughs> We just keep missing each other. We have to stop meeting like this. We have to stop meeting at all, actually. Okay, let's look for him. Hey! Yeah, I should have been more careful. I was lazy. Why'd I do that? Whoopsie, Vex, what did you do that for?
Don't you dare. You punk. You punk! Whoa! You're all punks! I don't tolerate. Tolerate. I don't tolerate hooliganery. Goodbye. I had a feeling you were gonna be. Oh no! Be a hooligan, and I wasn't gonna put up with it. Same with you, dude. I've had so much trouble with you in the past. We're just not doing it today. It's just no. You are gonna behave yourself today. Oh, there's an extra life. Over there, too. I don't care. <laughs> I have such a good attitude while playing this game. Everything I see, I just don't care about. I don't care about that. And I don't care about this. I don't really care about much of anything. In the belly of the beast, Short's chest deserves a look. The key to its release is hidden in the book. The book. Do you guys know what book they are talking about? I know. I know what book they mean. Let's get eaten now. Let's go get munched. Eat me! I'm delicious! That guy's still spinning over there. Sometimes I like games that aren't made super well. Cause you get funny stuff like that. Come on, dude. Uh-oh. Come on. I wanna know how he's gonna spin. No! Okay. That didn't go well. How long is- How long is he gonna spin? That's so funny. Oh my goodness gracious. Yeah, I love glitchy games. They're the best. Oh, he finally stopped. That was great. Okay, well. Got to go through an ice cave now, of course. What was that? What was that? Oh my. Punch him slowly. You're next. Here I come! Can I cross that gap? I don't even know. Where am I? Whoa. <laughs> wow. I survived. Here it is. That's for something else later. That's for the soul jars, which are in those areas. We'll need the boat, the big flying uh, ship thingy for that. Okay, let's try it. No! Aww. Try it again, Vix. Bet you could do it though if you jump just right. <laughs> I bet you could. I don't know, I'm gonna try a little bit more. Then I'll try the official way again. <laughs> Yeah, I'm losing a lot of lives, aren't I? <laughs> Come on. I don't know. Ha ha ha! 